Oh God, Alana, you're here, really. <laughs> Hello. So I didn't even see, I was on the PlayStation just watching Rob's video from earlier. Um, I didn't even, it weren't even coming up that we were live, so. Let's try again. There we go. Play, obviously I want you to play. Smash that like button, Alana. Hello to everyone joining. Hi Kaya, hi Alexi. Smash that like button, guys. I'm fine, thank you, Lex. Uh, Kaya, even. <laughs> I'm good, thank you, Lexi. Hi Josh, how you doing, buddy? Thank you, Kaya. Thank you, Lexi. Rob, just to let you know, I prefer number one. Hello, hello, hello. How you doing, David? You all right, buddy? Good to see you. Sorry I left earlier. I couldn't hear you, buddy. Just had a hell of a stream, did you? I didn't know you were live, Josh, or I'd have watched. I've been sat here twiddling my thumbs for the past hour. Cheers, Josh. Can't hear it in like three different directions. I'm speaking it, hearing it, and then hearing it. Hello, Sean. Long time no speak. Feels like ages since I spoke to you. Like the thumbs up button. Cheers, David. Everyone's leaving already. <laughs> Two bush gaming. Pun. <laughs> Pun. Busy, not bush. <laughs> Too busy gaming. <laughs> How is everyone this fine evening? I'm fine, Alana, thank you. Yeah, I'm live every Saturday and Sunday, Monday to Wednesday from 7 p.m. if you can, if you come and see me live. Okay, buddy, I'll come tomorrow. Okay, David. Hello, Jar. BLB, just gonna go and grab my washing left on the line, okay. Okay, buddy, I'll come tomorrow. Monday and Wednesday, well, I'm off Wednesday. I'm having a night off, so um, I'll come Wednesday night as well. So, my new darts lights here. Um, see it up there. The big silver ring. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Look at that. Hello, Kirsty. I want to see how much it brightens the room up. Hold on, guys. Now it's getting dark. Well, that really does brighten up. I want to see how much it brightens the room up. Hold on, guys. Now it's getting dark. Can you see me? How well can you see me? If I sit here with the light, I'll save some electricity. Oh, I like that. <laughs> Just made a tea for the occasion. Ooh. What's the box? That was the box that come in. Um, but I don't want to get rid of it just in case it didn't work because it's got like a month's guarantee on it. So if it didn't work, I've kept the box that come in. What's the box? That was the box that come in. Um, I don't want to get rid of it just in case it didn't work. Well, that's light. Yeah. Uh, Liam has gone. No, I'm still here, buddy. Someone made my teeth for me. Ooh. I like this. Um, Maybe I need a haircut again. Need the sides of my hair off, I think. Just get the, let the top grow, but the sides, well, my skivvies at work. <laughs> I've just shared my latest video. Okay, buddy. Off, I think. Just get the top grow, 
creepy theme park. Ooh. Creely, oh, Creely theme park. Okay, buddy. Had to make me own. That's not good. That's not on, is it? That is not on. Yeah, I feel like I need a, a little cut on the sides and the back. I've got a new video out today. What kind of video? Anyway, yeah, I like number one. I like edit one, Rob. Yeah, I feel like I need a Is there a quiz tonight? No, Lex is not, um, unfortunately. There's one on Thursday night. Um, imagine heavily pregnant girl has to make her own tea. Is there a quiz oh, that's no, terrible to know. Yeah, you look a right mess. I know, Sean. Tell me about it. You have to watch it later, Rob. Oh, that's his her. I've got to change that. Spell check. Someone didn't use it. Hi, Josh. See, this is the more, this is better because it's not spelt right now. It's spelt right. No, it's not. What? I've just changed it. Hi, Teresa. I'm fine, thank you. Oh, that's, that's better. Is that better? Yeah, finally. Um, finally. If you haven't already, smashed that like button, guys. Oh, no, not this again, Rob. Just a kid's clothes and bedding wasn't much at all. Oh, okay. Didn't take you long. So my light isn't even on tonight. It's just run by this this light here. Well, well lit. I uh, probably should turn the other one, but at 247 now. Okay, buddy, that's good. Everyone subscribed to Thrill Six if you haven't already. How do you smash or indeed push the light button? Um, are, is your phone like hor landscape or horizontal? Because if it's horizontal, you basically just press the little like. X in the corner, come off that, then press like, then press live chat again. Your TV is annoying, I apologise. What's that vertical, Sean? It's blue and thing. Come on. Save the electricity. Is it saving electricity having that on? Is it saving electricity having that on? Can I have a spanner again, please? Promise I won't use it again. No. You're on a spanner ban. You can have it back some point next week. I know at 44 subs. I would love to get to 50. Everyone subscribe to Larson Coasters as well, guys. Big shout out to him. Done it. Absolutely smashed it. Thank you. You did. You smashed it. Well done. Josh, 51 subs. I like your new, um, your new, your new photo, David, for the channel. I really like that. Yep, you're on a, you're on a ban.
I think we're getting a new tripod. I don't like this one. It's too high maintenance. Um, so yeah, I'm thinking about getting a new one. I just have that for me darts. I'm going to have a look at new tripods. Hold on. While I'm on here. I took it off him straight away. As soon as he um, picked you on a timeout, you're entertaining the cat. <laughs> yeah, as soon as I put him on a, as soon as he picked you on a timeout, I took him off it after. No, not you, Sean. The other Sean. A different Sean. I like that. 21 quid. I am very upstanding. <laughs> well, we wouldn't ban you. Just setting up the uh, pop-out chat. Um, I want to kind of have this somewhere. I'm going to put that there, I think. So I have to keep leaning down every time I want to use it. And I've got to stick my arm out. Oh, that flower pot's in the way. And this is also in the way. We're getting there. One day I'll find out how to set this up right. How I want it to be set up one day. No, I'm not. I'm just moving things around, so I don't have to keep leaning over, of leaning down, and stuff like that. Um, it's just so much easier. There you go. Got this worked out to a tree. There you go. Perfect. Perfect. All sorted. There you go, I think I've done it. Uh, what have I missed? Uh, what's in the box, Sam? Uh, it's the box of my new darts light. Um, so basically, uh, it's got like a month's guarantee, guarantee on it. Um, so... In case it messes up or anything like that, I'm just. In case it messes up, I've got. Um, I can send it back.
that glass was getting in my way. I want to put my arm on here and on here when I'm all relaxed. Thanks to the ones that are subbed. You will get a shout out in the live tomorrow. Definitely know you can watch the box. Do it, Kaya. Just subscribe, they don't say. Fancy you another know, Bulmers. Kaya, okay, get another Bulmers, I'm sure. Oh, well, she can pay for you and next year on the big lies. I'll try to convince. Yeah, sounds good. Okay, okay, then. She'll pay for you too, though. <laughs> oh, someone else outside's having a bonfire and it stinks. But it's so hot in my room. I can read, but. <laughs> Josh, I mean, you need to get 53 for 100 subscribers. I smell that. Yeah, it stinks. Absolutely stinks. Hashing pay for me to go to Orlando. If you haven't already, guys, smash that like button. get rid of that rubbish somewhere <laughs> yeah it's definitely not just wood I can tell you that now Do you know it smells like it smells like burnt rubber capital smash yeah smash potato already smashed that lava and cheers David I've liked but when I win the lotto Ah, Rob, she'll get great. She'll be very grateful. You gonna work? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna see if I can smell it too. <laughs> I can. Oh, you can smell the bonfire from over from it, switch can you? <laughs> smell, not see. <laughs> Your neighbours downstairs, Joel. Huh? <laughs> Why are the kids' t-shirts more than expensive than the other ones? I have absolutely no idea, Teresa. I felt left out. Oh, okay. Rub my eye after picking up a mental fever. Rookie mistake, rookie mistake. Oh, okay. Rob, you got exposed. <laughs> I 
They smoke a smelly smoke, a smelly smoke, that smells smelly. Yeah. Also, forget you need a new school, school bag. Just happens. We sell school bags. <laughs> Rather than with a major hay fever. Also, I made a mistake. Rookie, rookie. Too much social media work. I need. I also can smell the stink outside. <laughs> I need info on custom t-shirts for the two of us. Uh, Rob, Rob's the you, you, Rob's the one to ask on that, David. They need to go back to school to worry about a school bag and stickers for you to stick everywhere. Why well, need school bags for a while? Hunter needs a bag for nursery. Everyone's just reminded me saying about school bags. Yeah, well, you know where to get it. Um, your hairy knee is disturbing me, is it? <laughs> but surely the kids need to practice putting their new school bag on and fitting the books in. Yeah. By now, get prepared, Teresa. I think that's what Rob's trying to say. A shout, big shout to Byron Eaglen again. Nice to see you, buddy. No worries, mate. Need to buy one of those school ba book bags soon. Yeah, sh um, Rob, can you make a book bag? Schools won't be able to afford books. <laughs> Sorry, sound vaguely political now. <laughs> Rob, did you get breakfast? Do I... Do you guys have a drink bottle? Uh, I'm sure Rob can maybe sort that out. The kids, pro hello Kelly, how you doing? The kids probably won't go back till September. They should go through the school holidays. <laughs> the kids heard Liam's angelic voice and now they're both on the sofa. Hello kids, how are you? Has your dartboard been to the vets today? Oh, it got peppered. Um, but. I'm into the vets. <laughs> it's got a new light. Oh, I see what you're saying. That's a light. If you, if you look. That's what it does, and they'll turn the light off. Hence the box in the corner in case I have to send it back as well, Michael. <coughs> Hello to everyone joining. Uh, if you haven't already, smash that like button. Every like really is appreciated.
Luckily, the kids are sound out and I ain't listening to Liam. That's rude. That is rude. Um, like a halo, mate. It is cool. Um, it's 71 quid. Well, 72 quid, so I hope it is cool. Um, looks like a pet collar. Yeah, I got that after. Um, luckily, the kids aren't certain that Teresa, we are hoping to. I did stream it the other day. Couldn't hear my commentary, eh? No video on the channel tomorrow. 11 a.m. So in the end, last night, we got to our target. We had 20 people in, 20 different people in over the night that liked it. Um, 101 views that live stream got in the end. Um, so we'll say it's 101 people, but only 20 people liked it. Um, so thank you to everyone that come in. Um, and if you haven't already, smash that like button because that really helps us grow as a channel. Um, when you love your dartboard so much, you become sugar. Do you know, do you know what, Jelena? Right. I got the sound for free, yeah. But the dartboard itself and the um, the light, I come. That's like, that's 122 pounds worth of stuff. That is. Just a dartboard and a light for the dartboard, £122. Um, chubby Bunny Challenge tomorrow. It depends if Rob's doing that, Teresa. Finished building Nemesis, completed the waterfalls, but lots of landscaping to do. Um, okay, buddy. I did see you put a thing on, um, on uh, Twitter. Thank you, Kelly. Really appreciate it. I've sorted out my playlist. That's good. It doesn't surprise me enough. Looks like a wheel rim, Liam. <laughs> uh, it doesn't surprise me nothing is cheap in Liam's world. That's true. I never get the cheapest stuff. Do you know what, though? I'll tell you what, it's the best dartboard because the reason why is because if not, then I just have spare dartboards laying around where I've peppered them so much over time and they're unusable. Um, that's where my spare board sits, just there. Um, so I bought the best dartboard I can. Um, that's the most expensive dartboard you can buy, that I'm aware of anyway. Um, st still tip dartboard, not soft tip. Um, and that is one of the cheapest light surrounds you can get. Um, and the surround was free, but I'm going to buy a surround next week. Um, don't tell Liam about hamwiches. Oh, I love hamwiches. Oh, hamwiches are so good. Oh, this radio is really burning me. How do I turn it off? Oh, it's the other side. Uh, so I've just spoken to Sean, everyone. He can't come on tonight, but he says, everyone, hello, apart from Alana. Sorry, Alana, <laughs> his words. <laughs> he likes hamwiches anytime. Oh, yeah, hamwiches are the best. They bum. But rib burgers, yeah. Oh, <laughs> stick a rib burger in front of me and um, yeah, we're getting married. Don't even buy them for the kids, I buy them for me. <laughs> I have one left in the freezer. Sean, can you bring it round to me? Um... Rob, have you played Horizon, Horizon Zero Dawn? He eats it like a girl. What's that supposed to mean? He's joking, Alana. See you later, Lexi. See you, Kaya.
moth, go away. Uh, not worth it. Might chuck it to you from the friends. Yeah, do it. <laughs> Loved Horizon, best open world game on PS4. That's a statement. That is a statement, Sean. Oh, this radiator. That bonfire now smells like Camelot. You know, just that, Michael will know this. Michael and Rob will know this. You know when you like just walking around Camelot? And you have that, that smell. I can't describe it, but there's that smell that Camelot's got. And that's what it smells like. It's a definite buy. Talking to Liam about that earlier, hoping it will be on PS now this month. No. It's not damn. It's like... I can't explain what the smell is, but... It smells just like Camelot. Michael, are you still in here? Farming. I, I'm going now. Okay, see you later, David. Told him earlier. I only remember the smell of freshly made fudge and donuts. I meant more particularly now. It's just that rusty burnt smell. That's, that's what I think of when I was complete opposite to last month. Yeah, Uncharted 4 last month, and then this month, farming something like 19. <laughs> I used to make fudge in the early 90s next to the Tower of Terror. Oh, that sounds nice. But it's all worked up so I can have like the internet. Uh, so all my YouTube slides, um, all our social medias on here as well. And also have the chat on the left. So I've got it all worked out. I have PSN now, like the City game. PSN now is better than that, than Plus. Would you recommend it, Sean? Cake and biscuits. Yeah, but I'm not because I played Uncharted yesterday. But that's the thing, I'd buy it if it would um if it's got decent games on there with decent internet connection, yes. What do you mean by that, though? Is it like streaming games, or is it not actually owning the games? Do you not get to own the games? It was very nice. Didn't get that at Alton Towers or BPB. <laughs> no, you had donuts, though. Oh, not Uncharted. The whole world played it two years ago or so. Yeah, but I didn't, so... You can download the PS4 games. You stream them there, so no good for you. 
What, you're not going to get to play him? I only strain the PS3 ones. Why is that? Charlotte drank my tea. She didn't like it. How can someone not like tea? Hmm. I'm more of a coffee than a tea person, but I'd love tea. Don't get me wrong, but PS2 ones. Why? Why? Why the PS? The old PS ones. Hunter isn't a big fan, Marnie would probably down it to be honest. <laughs> but you can download the PS4 games, however, some games are only there for a limited time. What, so did you not own the games? Like you would if you got downloaded my PS, uh, PS Plus? I'm going to have a look. I'm going to have a look. I find it weird when someone doesn't like tea. Like, are you even British? <laughs> Bit of a stereotype there. Eight ninety nine a month, that's expensive. Start your free trial. Why not? No, but you don't own PS Plus because if you cancel your subscription. That's true, yeah. I'm gonna do the PS now. Seven day subscription, not free subscription thing. Well, wow. it probably is too slow, but as it's free, if it's really bad, I won't buy it. If, it's, if I can, oh, not available for purchase. Why? That's rude. All right, well, I'm not doing that then. I might just download Farming Simulator though. Because, like, why not? Oh, okay. See, for me, it's still saying uh, Uncharted 4 and Dirty Rally 2. So I'm now just going to download Dirty Rally 2. But I, 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 um, I downloaded that, do you remember the monster game? Um, the, the, um, the monster motorbikes one. I got that as well, but I didn't really like it. Yeah, Dirty Rally 2's, Dirt Rally 2's now up, like, downloading. Oh. I just found out you can get the combat pack. I haven't purchased it. I want to purchase it now. Oh, these things just stress me out. Last of Us is the best game of all time. Also a big statement. I'd stay, still say Call of Duty, well, Modern Warfare 2 was, but. Top three Star Wars films. I talked to Sean about that, he'll know. Sean loves his Star Wars.
Sean's favourite saga. <laughs> I would agree with Rogue One, awesome film. It's so uncomfortable being crammed in this little corner. I hate to say it, but I can't wait for mum to go back to work. <laughs> I just don't like Star Wars, so. When mum's back at work, um, we're back downstairs. Chris Hatch will be back and um, and I'm not really cramped in a little corner. Oh, hello, that's a question. Uh, Liam, do you know the Switch track on Expedition Everest costs more than 13 at Alton Towers? No, I didn't know that. Um, so it's a fact that I didn't know. <laughs> uh, hi, Laura, how you doing? Nice to see you. Budget-wise, I didn't know that. This turns a rather weird conversation. <laughs> you got a new best friend, Sean. Okay, Josh. Smash that like button, Laura. Smash that like button, Laura, if you haven't already. He has good taste. <laughs> Good thanks, just drinking, so won't be staying long, but I'll retweet on Twitter. I hope you're okay. Yeah, I'm good, thank you, Laura. Thanks for dropping in. You're a little session, are you, Laura? Liam, even if you don't like Star Wars, you should watch Rogue One. No, I've never watched a Star Wars film, and I don't think I ever will. So, uh, sorry.
more like a war for them, especially at the end. Sean has never watched Harry Potter. Sean, uh, don't try and convince me about Star Wars if you've never watched Harry Potter. Like, just don't. <laughs> Seriously, that like, you can't. Harry Potter's like the greatest film of all time, like the greatest saga of all time. Like, just can't bring myself to. It's like it's Sean. It's like the best saga of all time. Shocking, mate. Absolutely shocking. He has no idea who Dobby is. Oh, sure. Now we're not even going to be... We're not friends no longer. Nah. Kelly, you need to make him binge watch it. Kelly, you need to make him watch it. He's not allowed to sleep until he watches it. Rob, don't even try to be funny. You know exactly who Harry Potter is. He will when lockdown's over. Trust me. <laughs> Sean, I'm telling you now, when lockdown's over, we're binge watching Harry Potter. No choice, buddy. Harry Potter, who is he? Sh oh, that's not funny, Rob. That is not funny, Bert. <laughs> Not nice one, Bert. Oh, I'm so uncomfortable in this little corner. Pillow, time's to come down. <sighs> when you was a kid, that's like 20 years ago, do you know? I, I delivered to the studio, but he never ordered again after. Says a lot that does about you. I'm only 22, but yeah, but when you say a kid, how old were you when you were as a kid? <laughs> it was only 12 years ago. Don't you find it strange that he is the most famous wizard, famous wizard, but everyone in the films keep asking if he's Harry Potter, even Mr. Weasley and you, and, and you are, he said. Yeah, but they know of him. They don't know who he is because he was a baby when it hit the news, didn't it? Sean, don't even, mate. Don't even come onto my stream and stream and try diss Harry. Harry is a real, he is the real gangster. He is the original gangster, the OG. He's the OG, mate. How could anyone try diss Harry? Ron, Ron, Ron Weasley. <laughs> Bit like I got, Rob, you can get off and all if you're gonna sit here and do that. <laughs> Master has given me clothes. I'm free. What? No, I didn't. 
Master has given me a sock. I had just thought the actors hadn't grown into their roles yet in episode four. Oh, oh, well, we're back to Star Wars. Hi, Josh. I've never seen Rocky Horror either, to be fair. The tone was slightly off, I think. You talking about Star Wars or Dobby? Yeah, I haven't already, guys. So mash at that at the like button. I love Harry Potter. I literally cried when Dobby died. Yeah, I know. I know. Oh. See, I know nothing about Star Wars, so. Have nothing to say on Harry Potter. Sean, I'm telling you, when this lockdown's over, mate, we are binge watching. Goblet of Fire and Deathly Hallows 2 are my fave of the film. Best line, let us finish this, how we started together, or something like that. Yeah, I know roughly what you mean. My favourite was Chamber of the, Se Chamber of the Se Secrets. Never would. You will. You've got no choice, mate. Kelly will sit. Kelly will hold you down and you will watch it. Run, 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 run. Weasley. Chamber of Shamans. <laughs> no, he doesn't, Jay. No, he doesn't. <laughs> I am losing it. You lost it ages ago, Sean. But don't worry, we'll fix it when I make you binge watch Hopa. He's too, like, square-headed. He does a little. No, he's got a really square head. Harry Potter doesn't. When Harry was a kid. Mm, no, I still don't see it, to be honest. We scared the cat. Well, that's not nice. So, Kelly, are you up for that? Just holding him down and we'll binge watch it. When a film is new, characters take a while to develop. Mark Harrison and Carrie were excellent. Oh, Harry Potter. <laughs> not Harry Potter. The cat has emotions. Yes, they do, Jenna. I'm locking the door for the rest of the year. No, you're not. Kelly will let me in. We both know that. You need to watch Star Wars. I'll watch Star Wars when Sean's watched every single every single film of Harry Potter. But until then, no. Simba doesn't have it. He does. He's my best mate. No, nah, he's my best friend. Oh, I've just gone onto the advanced YouTube studios to like the really, really technical parts of the analytics and I have no idea what they mean. I've got to go, stay safe and see you all tomorrow. Have fun. See you later, Laura. Nice, nice of you to come on. He is broken. Oh, oh, you're on about Simba. I thought you were about Sean. <laughs> oh, 
She should have read the instructions, shouldn't she, Dana? language jar or letters I should say so hope F1 goes ahead that's another comment sure um, apparently Carriage is Domino's is closed. Really? Bit rude, really. I'll just put a sock on the cat. Yeah, you do that. Throw a cucumber at him. Cats are scared of him. No, don't do that. That's mean. Went to Camelot for a walk around the lake. Park always putting trespassers warning on all cars that park there. Be aware of that. <laughs> Can't believe Domino's is closed. That's shocking. I love Domino's. I love Domino's. Domino's is rash. No, no, no. Come in. Can I borrow your phone? Yeah, can I borrow your phone? Why? Because I want to uh, order food. No. Why? Order off black Yeah, but it's not the same, is it? What are you ordering? Don't know. I wanted Domino's, but they're closed. Really? Yeah, Domino's is closed. What time is it closed? I don't know. 
It's not even 10 o'clock yet. Oh, it's 10 o'clock now. So it's going to have to be Harry's kebab. It's so annoying because the Domino's used to close at like 3 o'clock in the morning. I know. Too late for food. No, it's not. I'll cook your food, the pizza, if you come and get it. No, I'm all right. Do I've just looked on the Domino's. I know. I've just looked at um, Domino's online. They're saying they're closed. I'm hungry, like, there's nothing. I've got a chicken, like, my chicken. What's all that pasta with? If I don't want to cook. It's not, you could put the milk away. No, I always cook it. Oh, no, your one. Yeah. I didn't like it. Um, it wasn't very nice, sorry, Lauren. You just don't like vegetables. Say it later, Lana. What are you doing? I'm going to get a green tea. Weirdo. See, she called You are fat. <laughs> I'm joking. If you got to order Domino's, what do you think about? I don't even know how much money I've got left. So it might work, it might not. So, I don't even know how much money I've got, so I might I might go put this in the basket and it might just bounce, so <laughs> I don't know. Um Are they uh, it's an it's an inside joke me and Lauren have. What? She wants me to motivate her so she does her workout and stays healthy. Huh? Yeah. It, it's not me actually being horrible, she wants me to motivate her. She's even her pro, her um her wallpaper photo on her phone is her, her at her worst. <laughs> so she looks at it and goes, "Nah, got any sense about this?" <laughs> Sometimes it's a bit uncalled for when you come to my room and say, "Oh my god, you look so fat." <laughs> you know, I can't talk, so you know it's a joke. <laughs> I don't think you were joking earlier. I was. Um, <laughs> I know I can't find the mixed kebab that I was looking for. Hi, Geordie, how you doing? I can't find a mixed kebab. What is this about? Oh, here we go. Um, what's lamb sheesh? A sheesh kebab. What's a sheesh kebab? Is it the one in the sauce? Does anyone know what a sheesh kebab is? Isn't it sheesh? I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's the one that comes in the... It's like a tin, isn't it? Yeah. It's like little squares of lamb. You know, when you go to Joby Grill and it's got the pictures. I'll just get chicken and lamb done, I think. Garlic mayo. <laughs> no salad. <laughs> Obviously no salad. Um, yeah, I know I need oh, to sit. It was so hard not to like, get something nice to eat in the shop. Why? What did you get in the end? You got any ideas? You got any ideas what I could react to? Stuck for ideas. Uh, Liam and the swimming pool. Me and the simple. Yeah, check out that video. Uh, Lauren Willis's YouTube channel. <laughs> um, me and a me and a swimming pool for twelve hours. React to that. All right. You can react to that, buddy. Uh, see you later, Sean. All the best. It from the grease. What's from the Greece? Oh, hello, Sean. What did you put? It's been removed already, so I'm guessing it went nice. Do I want salad? Don't be so silly. Of course I don't want salad. Have you seen me? You're being mean again. 
See you later, Kelly. What are you ordering? A uh, kebab, a burger, just to make the money up, really. Um, I know I'll eat it, so um, it's not going to be much of a strain. Got to spend two pound forty for delivery. Why? And why do you always expect so much? I don't see what your problem is. It might not even go through. I don't even know how much money I've got, so it might have enough. It might not. Spicy mushrooms? Why not? I know, I've gone for spicy. We don't have mozzarella sticks. We're not that blessed. Um, might go through. It might not. Um, order enough just eat. Yeah. Now I've got to try to remember everything. So this is where you should be delivering me food because you're a kebab delivery driver. When it comes, go on Just Eat Live chat and complain and I'll refund you. Really? I'll do that. To be fair though, I don't even know if I'm gonna have money to do it, so. Might do, might not. We're about to find out. Waiting confirmation, so I'm guessing it's gone through. We're about to find out. Hey, it went through. Now I definitely am poor, though. Is that how you get free food? Is it Sean? Tell him it was cold. Oh, yeah, Sean, look at this. I am the queen of YouTube. Oh, are you? Oh, I take it you work with Justine. I am the queen of YouTube. What do you think, Sean? Do you love it? She look like Sam Brett. No. I'm never going to wear it again now. You've just ruined it. You've ruined everything. So thanks for that, mate. <laughs> yes, Josh, you've got it. You've got it in one. You hit it. Hit the nail on the head there, buddy. Probably for the best, un unless you're going to Pride. No, don't plan to. Is it somewhere you can go and vlog? I've never been. I've never been, so I, I walked through it um, in London when I went to see Titanic the Musical with my mum. It was to Gay Pride that weekend, and we had to walk through it uh, to go to the theatre. Is Rob actually still in here? He hasn't spoken ages. Bert, you're still here. I feel like Bert's just gone. I'm stuck for ideas. I think we all are, buddy. Um, I suppose the most go-to one. What's your top ten roller coaster? Top ten theme park? Top ten. Um, top 10 bucket list coasters. 
Titanic musical with your mum. Are you sure you don't eat from the other side of the from other sides picnic? I don't get that, um, but I'm going to guess that that's not a nice thing, so I'm going to ignore it. Uh, uh, I'm here. Why are you being like that, Rob? Can't wait. Sean, what do you think of the new light? You ready? you ready to see it? But if we get this as well, you're going to love this. You are going to love this, guys. Move me darts out of the way. You're going to love this. Yeah, oh, okay. I can assure you I only go one way. Not that it matters. But this is where you're going to love it even more. Ready? Look at that. Disco. And then if we turn this off. Can what be attached to Chris the light? Where do you think the little disco? <laughs> Funny, Rob. Well, yeah, it's Saturday night, so why not? I'm not at work, which is where I'd normally be on Saturday. Um, if I could be. So, create my own pub. Looks like the loneliest party ever. Well, it is. Um, it's quite lonely. As you can see, I'm here on my own. Um, but I won't be when my food comes because I'm going to have a random stranger rocking up at my door soon. Whoop, whoop. Oh, by myself. Invite him into the service, your pipe. <laughs> Not funny. I thought she was going to come in here then. It was adequately funny. No, I don't think it was. Yeah, look. I'm just going to sit here. Alright. Sit yourself. Don't turn it's the disco back on, might scare them off. Oh, I had the disco going. <laughs> yeah, if you turn that, um, turn the lot of them. Oh, no, I'll put the bulb in there. Was it a normal one originally? It was for house parties at uni. Was it? So it's why have I now It's a normal got? desk clamp. It's a small room. What, so it was just a normal light in there before and you put... Well, you just buy a lamp normally, don't you? And then you put a normal bulb in there. But mm. then you, you get them from a pound land, I think. I'd rather have a normal lamp, though. Mm. You could put a normal light bulb in there. Yeah, it's not funny, Sean. Not funny, mate. <laughs> you just can't resist yourself, can you? But you can just take it back now if you want, because I don't actually want it. I don't want that. So I've, I've got to have it in my room, because you don't want it. You've had another Pepsi, haven't you? I've had one more. That was, that was for the other gin. That was the one I bought you at the shop the other day and told you not to worry about. That's not the point of saying don't worry about it. <laughs> 
found two old pound coins today. Did you? Yeah, I'm going to save them and then work £100. No, you know you could just go, if you go to... Yeah, but if I save them until I'm about 85 and then sell them... Yeah, that probably won't happen. You'll probably end up just getting bored and going to the bank and change them up. No. I was explaining that we had to walk through Gay Pride when we went to see Titanic the Musical. Where did you see it? London. London, yeah. Did you order food? Yeah, I did. I had a chicken and lamb donna mix kebab. Um, and then... Burger. Oh, I got a burger. We got burgers downstairs. You can go cook yourself one. They taste like shrimp. Don't say that. Rob's in there. And Rob's in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Rob, but they do. <laughs> she don't like direct meats, mate. Don't say that, Rob. Don't say that, Rob. Rob, she don't like direct meats burgers. I actually really liked them. No. Neither do I. Oh, you're not the only one that don't like it. Can't wait till Tuesday right. and Wednesday because I'm not going live. <laughs> two days off. I'm going on until Monday, which is two weeks. Two weeks of live streams. And then I'm having two days off. And then I'll do two weeks, two days off. Two weeks. Why two... don't you have like one day off and then another day on? Like do it every other day? I could do, but we've got into a little routine now. Well, no, you haven't because you haven't had a break yet. So you could just do a day on, a day off. Mm, could do. I'll put a poll out on Twitter and the people can answer. Ask me questions, guys. No. All right, then, sorry. This won't be a late live stream tonight. It definitely won't be um, a three-hour stream tonight. No chance. <laughs> Basically, until you food gets here. No, I'll stay until 11 four people. What time did you turn it off last night? Uh, one minute past midnight. Yeah, one minute past, I went off last night. I was so hungry. No, I don't. Is someone on our street on a bonfire, by the way? Yes, yeah, next door but one. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chop you? Wood chop, chop, not chuck, chop. Do you now? That's nice. Well done. Wood chop. The thought park said, How much wood would a wood chop chop if a wood chop could chop you, chop you? So I replace all the chucks for a chop. And that's thought park. You're actually so strange. I can't wait till Planet Coaster comes out on the uh, on the PlayStation. It's gonna be awesome. No, on the PlayStation, it's not. So on, um, it's just keeps saying coming to console in summer 2020. Like, come on, just give me a release date. Put me at ease. So on, um, just keep saying coming to console in summer 2020. Like, come on. Oh, it's on PC. What should my first theme park be? I'm not doing Fort Park, Rob. To be fair, Sean is awesome at that. He is. I, I I have watched some of them. He is awesome. The attention to detail he has is awesome. Yeah, he loves his rock work. Rock work is on point. He loves his horticulture. His landscaping. 
No, I want one difficult, Rob. I want, want one where I can put an RM, that's got an RMC. So maybe Wallaby Holland. <laughs> I did not know that. <laughs> you know the guy that picked up my um, that picked up my my um, the dartboard, Lauren. He just messaged me. Obviously, yeah. he's doing the delivery driver. He said, "Do you want a can with your food, mate?" <laughs> I didn't know he worked there. <laughs> oh no, on Facebook. Oh. I won't say no to a free Dr Pepper. <laughs> oh, come on, load. Because I can't reply in there. Come on, load. So slow, this laptop. No, Rob. I said an RMC. I will never build Tato Park. You can build Tato Park, but I'm not going to do that. Oh my goodness gracious me, come on. Oakwood's got a potential. Um, I could potentially do Oak, uh, Oakwood, but I think I'll do Wallaby first, and then I might do Oakwood. Uh, Planet Coaster. Ask him if I put in a Dark Pepsi. No, Dr. Pepper. <laughs> we technically know I'm your Dark Pepsi. I don't care. Out of this box. Yeah, you do. Party. Mind, not mid. So look at that. You do someone a favour. You give them a dartboard. I, I did. I did not, not doing Fort Park. <laughs> Fort Park's so overdone. Um, I might just see the point. Cedar Point could be one I could do. Cedar. Cedar. You just said Cedar. Oh, they look amazing, don't they? I think you should make them. Uh, Lauren, you got to remember one thing, though. I can't cook. I'm bloody no. Language. I will. I'll, I'll force myself to have the patience, Rob. Is this all mine in here? Yeah. How much money is in here? I don't know. Shall we count? Yeah, go on, count it. Unless you download a pre-built one. I'll give it a go. I've watched loads of instructions from Sean Sandberg. Oh, yeah. oh, this is exciting times. Heavy though, isn't it? It is. I feel like only like five people in one Oh, hello. It's all mine. Uh, I don't know, it's been in my room for the last like, set, a year, yeah, two years. So I think we should go halves on it. <laughs> Absolutely not. Halves. Well, I'm going to organise the piles. Alright, we've got to go halves though. No. Yeah. No, it's mine. <laughs> but I've been storing it for you. So? How much would you pay a storage About company? Percent. How much would you pay a storage company? To store a piggy bank. Lights hard, I've played it on my laptop and it involves a lot. Yeah, I know, but I watch a lot of instruction videos from Sean. They are gonna, they are gonna hum like pure iron. You know what? I can wash my hands. Are you done? <laughs> I need to refresh this one. Oh my god, there's a twenty p. <laughs> oh, what is that pound? Oh, that's a euro. How awesome is this? You give someone a dartboard and then you order food. Who's awesome left in the chat? You put I don't know. Money for like sixteen years and then you forget about it. 
That is awesome. Yeah, well, you might have a whole total of a pound. If I go to Europe, I can, I've got one euro and one cent. Oh, you can give that to us if you want when we go away. There you go, that'll be my donation. Oh, back in a sec, guys. Oh my God, this is going to be torture sitting here. The windows open, that's probably why. Oh, yeah. I don't like very really like coke that much, but you can have that because he didn't he he'd oh, already left. Oh right, I'll have it then. I'm back guys, I've got my food. No, he wasn't watching the screen. Yeah, Lauren opened the window and the curtain uh, the windows open. Oh my god, that smells so good. Hmm. He just said to me, next time we order from there, message him first, and he'll stick some extra stuff in there for us. Who is it? The guy that picked up that dartboard for me. Is Teresa going, is she? Oh, see you later, Teresa. Wait, you or Harry Club? Yeah. Oh, no, bam. Bam, Lauren. Good. Do you want one? Like Garlic mushrooms. <gasps> Hot. Mmm. Did you get chips? No. Tell you what, that is a good garlic mushroom. I've got an idea, I'm going to do a food do review. Because I don't eat chips. I'm going to do a food review. Mmm, there's some good quality mushrooms there. Mm. She don't want to try one though. No, I've got this money. Money finger. Hi, BM the girls. Um, how are you doing? Nice. Are we in for a Liam food review? We are. We are. Spon imagine if he got sponsored by Harrod Kebab. Oh, mate. Could you imagine? That would be the best. I might do that. I might message him. And say, I'm a YouTuber. Get Rob to screen record this bit and then just <laughs> send it to him. Lauren. Uh, Rob. Hi, David. Rob, screen, re screen record this. I'm going to do a food review. And um, send it to Harrod Kebab because they might sponsor me. <laughs> We're all good here in sunny Florida. Oh, how lucky. We've got miserable old England. <laughs> mm. There's at least a quid here. They are some good mushrooms. Are you sure you don't want one? I'm sure, thank you. Alright, screen record after. Oh, okay, buddy. So. Here, guys, we have the garlic mushrooms. Um, I think they're garlic mushrooms. Um, sound like they might be garlic. They taste like garlic mushrooms. Um, I'll put them in the bag for now. Um, order summary. Spicy mushrooms. They're not spicy. Um, I have to say, that. they're not spicy. That's rude, Rob. They're not spicy, but they are packed with flavour.
I'll have this one more and I'll have the rest later. Mm. And as I'm doing a food review, uh, from a food review club, drink watch, can of Coke. That's good. That is good. Right, so what we got next? Um, this is like the kebab, doesn't it? We'll go for the kebab next. Ten. Yeah. <laughs> Do you watch Food Review Club, David? I love his videos. Right. So I think, I think this was um, a mixed kebab. Right. Chicken and Donna. Oh, Lauren, look at that. Oh, that looks good. That looks amazing. Um, don't know how you can see that. Um, but this is a chicken that and... Smells really that smells amazing. Um, that's this packed with food. Um, it's this tight here. David from Phil Seek says hello. Hello. She says hello, David. It smells amazing. Looks very well cooked. You look at that, very well cooked. Um, bit of grease on there, but oh no, that looks amazing. So, mmm, mmm. It's good considering it's the end of the night as well. I tell you what, that it's like I've got a crispy crunch when you first try it, but other than that, it's really, really succulent. <laughs> I haven't got up my nose. That's really good. Um, that chicken's really good. Like an arcade over this side. <laughs> oh, this is the chicken donna, not just chicken strips, chicken donna. Mm. That is the one. It's like perfect consistency as well. It's like. There's not one bit that's hard, one bit that's soft. It's, it's all the same. Oh, okay, yeah, I did see she was doing that, David. That just looks amazing. Look at that. Sorry if this is making you all hungry, but that looks amazing. Let's get to the donna. Um, a little bit pale, pale in colour, but nice thick, thick cuts. Um, I like that with it, which is why I don't like Dover Cook Grill because they're really thin at Dover Grill. Um, but they have really thick cuts, not as much sauce as I'd like, but um, I love a really, really caked in sauces. Um, Congratulations. Oh, you're three away from 50 now. Uh, you'll get there, buddy, I promise you. Mm. Perfectly cooked. Go together. Chicken and the donna. All together. It's a bit of a big spoonful. I'm not sure I can get all that out of my mouth. Mm. That is top quality. Do you know, sometimes, like, we say this with Harry's kebab, it can be very inconsistent, can't it? Yeah. I mean, Rob, you'll be able to know. Um, when you have Harry's kebab, Rob, it can be very inconsistent at times, can't it? Mm. No, I'll be honest, it can be. When it's good, it's amazing. Um, but then times where... You usually just need a bit more sauce. 
yeah, it does. It just needs more sauce half the time. They, they can be quite... If you're watching this, um, put a lot more sauce on. Um, no, I don't I don't think that, Rob. Um, for me, it's the best kebab place in Harwich. Hands down. I wouldn't eat a kebab anywhere else. Mmm. Nah, Dover Grill ain't the one for me. It really isn't. Um, I went off that um, about three, four years ago. I went off Dover Grill because of how thin the meat was, and it just wasn't wasn't how I liked it. Um, so I stopped going there, and I started ordering from Harwich Kebab. Um, I've tried from loads of them, but Harwich Kebab for me is the best kebab. <laughs> no, it's not. David Grill's not. Mm. I like David Grill. They've got good chips. Mm. Right, before I go into the burger. David Grill chips and mayo. Mm. Going to the Nam, put a bit of Donna, some chicken in there. So we're at my little with the Donna. Um, Here's my donation to your road trip. Pitta, nah, whatever it is. Three euros and 24 cents. Mm. That's good. That's a good one. Mm. Really rate that. So, another thing I bought just to get it up to 15 quid was a burger. I can't remember if I got a half pounder or a quarter pounder to, uh, to bring it up. But um, we're going to see. Hmm? He's actually torched his corner. Torn it? Mm -hmm. All right then. Bye. 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 Uh, it's a half pounder. Um, must admit, it looks very. It's got a nice tire on the top. Could have done with a bit more on the grill, um, but garlic sauce and cheese. They're a bit mean on the cheese. Must admit, a bit mean on the cheese. Um, oh, that's really hot. That's really hot. I'm gonna have to let that cool down for a minute. Um, we'll get to the burger in a minute. Uh, we'll go back to the garlic mush, the spicy mushrooms. They're really good. Um, mm. Mm. I don't like it if it's in a burger. I don't mind it if it's in a burger. Mm. Look at that. That for a garlic mushroom. That's amazing. Um, jalapeno cheese is the best. Yeah, I like jalapeno cheese. Don't like that Carolina Reaper stuff though. All right, so we're gonna get into this burger. Mm. Mm. That's a good burger. Could be, like I said, could do with some more cheese in that. Um, if it weren't so harsh on the cheese, that would be a really good. It's 
sauce they went in with. I like that. No, it's good. Fish off the beer. Go back to watch. Drink watch. Sorry, I'm not staying this stuff for a favourite beer club, but um, I am going to use it because funny. Watch. <laughs> yeah, but no one's going to because Lauren can't because she's tortured and she's on some diet. Um, bun, cheese, burger, cheese, burger, cheese. Bun. That's how it should be done, yeah. You're right there. Uh, Liam, when you show him the beard, when I um, when I find my razor. Um, I'm doing a food review, Teresa. So I have three items, Teresa. I've got in here, Spicy garlic mushrooms, um, they're really good. Um, and here I've got a mixed donna and chicken, chick, uh, lamb and chicken donna. Um, and I've also got a cheeseburger. Um, Rob, stop being so mean. I'm absolutely ravenous. Ravenous, I haven't eaten in ages. Kurt tried to grab the steam she wants it. Oh, bless her. Mm. That's really good. I'll, get, I'll tell you what, though. Oh, I won't be going to bed for ages, though. <laughs> I was sat here, I was really hungry. That sauce, the garlic sauce at Harry's Kebab, okay, have I got it around my mouth? Um... The sauce, the garlic sauce at Harish Kebab, there isn't any better. I don't know where they get it from, um, but it's so good. I'm just saying, it's not like you were eating chicken the other day, or whatever you made on the plate. That was chicken and chips. Mm. Oh yes, David, I am. That's really good. If it had more cheese in it, I'd be... 10 out of 10 burger. Really food fast as well. It come literally within like 10 minutes, 15 minutes to me ordering it, as you all saw. Um, luckily I knew the guy. Um, which is where I got that drink from. No, honestly, Rob, it's not a 3 out of 10. It may not look the best. Uh, presentation will bring it down a few points because um, it just looks like a burger in a bun. But um, the flavours. I saw a party going on. Mm. No veg, no veg. I'm not a veg man myself. Oh, I think it's plain. Oh, no, not tomatoes. <laughs> I'm full though, I'm very full. Eating those three things. Um, so I'll be microwaved. What I don't eat will be microwaved and eaten um, either about three o'clock in the morning or in the morning. Mmm. Yeah, Rob, nail on the head, mate. Nail on the head. Mm. That's so good. So, as that ginger fella would say, r r r ratings time, ratings time, r r r ratings. Um. So we're going to the garlic mushrooms first. Um, they are so scrumptious. They're so soft. Uh, full of juices. The perfect amount of coating on it. 
You can see the spices in it. Mm. I'm not going to lie, I've had garlic mushrooms and spicy mushrooms from a few places, and I normally go, that's rude. No, that. The juices are from the mushroom. You bite into the mushroom. Mm. I've had garlic mushrooms, spice mushrooms from other places, and um, I don't like them. I'm not the time. I only got them to build up the, uh, the cost, but that... Those are some really good mushrooms. Um, I'd say they're probably. The, I'd say you're not even not even trying to over exaggerate. They're probably some of the best mushrooms I've ever had in terms of um, takeaway mushrooms. Uh, so mushrooms, I'm gonna give them about a seven out of ten. Um, if I was a little bit, because they class themselves as spicy mushrooms, if they were spicier, like actual like, then. Um, Rob, you need to like you. You are so uncultured. You've had one bad experience, and that's it. You hate it. Um, speaking of Greece, oh Liam, <laughs> not right now. Not right now. Um, they they classed it as a spicy gut mushroom. Um, make it spicy. Um, so that's why it's only about seven out of ten. Um, but other than that, the flavours are amazing. Go on to the kebab. Um, that thing's amazing. It smells amazing. The chicken is like. It's got a crispy top, but the meat is so soft and succulent. Um, that's amazing. The donna meat is thick, tasty. They could have put more. Um, the pita, as I've been corrected, um, was a little bit, little bit crispy, too crispy. Um, Harridge kebab, yeah. <laughs> the um, was a little bit overdone for me. I like it soft with a little crisp. Um, bit overdone. Uh, needs more needs more sauce. So out of that, I'm going to rate that kebab. Flavours alone, I'd rate that an 8 or a 9. Uh, but I'm going to rate that about a 7.4 because of the uh, <clears throat> because of the pitter and the not enough sauce. Um, we go for the burger now. The burger. Uh, the burger was amazing for flavours from the sauces, how the burger tastes, um, the char like the crispy, the charcoalness on the um, on the bun. Could add a little bit more of that. Um, could be could be more generous with the cheese. Um, so that I'm gonna rate that a I'm gonna rate that a seven point nine. Um, and then food and club again. Drink watch. Um, it's a can of coke. You can't go real wrong with a can of coke, can you? Uh, especially when they're cold, which this one is. That's good. So all in all, I'll probably, I'm going to go on an average, I'm going to say, at an average, that's a 7.5, 7.5. That's one of the best uh, takeaways I've had in a long time. Normally I regret getting a takeaway wherever I get it from. Um, that was really good. Um, great. Speed as well. Speed as well, getting it to me, was very good. Um... No one likes to wait an hour, hour and a half, two hours for their food. So 20 minutes, ample. Um, that's good. Customer service, great. Um, so yeah, Harry's Kebab. Awesome. Um, it was an awesome one. Like I've said earlier on, Harry's Kebab can be a little bit unpredictable. Um, can be. But on their good days, they are amazing. Um, on a good day, they're amazing. On a bad day, they're an average. You know, so like Dover Grill. Um, it's a Dover Grill level. Um, that was good. I enjoyed that. I'll eat the rest either later or tomorrow. That's good. Um, easy for you to go. It's near, nearer for you. She's got a point, Robert. <laughs> You only live very, like, very close. So what do you think of the review for my first food review? What do you think?
Let me know what you thought of the food review. Do you think that was a good food review? I thought it was a good food review. Okay then, I'm hungry now. Well, I think um, we did say about uh, doing hotel reviews and stuff like that. I think we're doing uh, theme park related food reviews um, as well. I can't wait to do a review on the grill. Ah, uh, the grill at Fort Park. I can't wait to do a review on them. I don't think I could. I don't think I could say a bad word about them. Have you tried the frozen kebab meat from Iceland? Um, I don't. I don't like frozen kebab meat. Should never be frozen. Uh, kebab meat should be fresh. Should never be frozen. Ocean Fish Bar do it. I had a kebab there once. I was very ill, so that's why I never had frozen kebab meat since. Um, so yeah, no, I haven't, um, and I don't think I will because frozen kebab meat not up my street. And of course, if you have like a frozen kebab, it's not the same, is it? You, any any takeaway, fake aways are never good. Um, tell you what, you could do a good fake away, you'd be laughing. Uh, splash landings. Okay, buddy. We'll is it on the? Is it on your uh, channel? Is it? Well, we haven't really a review. We could do a full review on it. Um, but I think when the theme parks and hotels are back open, Rob, um, we smash them out. Every hotel, good or bad. Good or bad, we, we do a review of. Homemade chicken kebabs are great. Under the foot, Alton Towers Place. Alright, check that out, mate. Um, <clears throat> chicken kebabs. I've never had a ch frozen chicken kebab um, before. So I'll try that. I might try that, but donut kebabs, donuts should never be frozen. It's criminal activity, if you ask me. Criminal, criminal activity. And I think that's half the reason why I don't like... Um, no, I mean, we're fresh chicken. Oh, okay. I think that's half the reason why I don't like do Dover Grill, because you know when they carve the... You know when they carve the donna? Um, they put it in the little pots, and those pots can be there for hours. That's why I don't like that. Got a little... What's that there? I can feel it. I don't know what it is. We used to love though. I know I used to. Um, and one day I went there, really excited for it. Um, had a kebab, and I didn't eat it. I had about three mouthfuls of it. And I ended up throwing it away. Um, I just think it's. I mean, it's a bit hard because I love the guys in Dover Grill. I really do. I love them all. Um, I know them, so it's a hard one to really say bad of them because they're all lovely guys. But I just. I'm just not a lover of their food. I mean, their pizzas are nice and their burgers are still nice. The burgers are still top quality, but the kebabs aren't for me. And that's what they're famous for, isn't it? The one up, uh, Tollgate's useless. Never go there. Um, trying to think where else is good for kebabs. That's it, isn't it? I only go Harry's Kebab if I fancy a kebab. Um... Chicken, USA, definitely USA for the chicken. Um, pizzas, Domino's or family pizza. Uh, uh, Chinese, when it's like Mandarin House, only go Mandarin House. Um, I swear by Mandarin House. Um, I could eat a Mandarin House every day. I love their food, absolutely love their food. Um, Where else? Indians. Uh, any Indian. I don't really know which one I eat from half the time. It's either the Joy, the Raj, the Joy, 
or the Raj, or there's about five of them all named the same thing. Um, so I don't know which one I eat from. It's the one that, um, it's just the first one that comes up on uh, Just Eat, to be honest. <laughs> Chinese, oh, I love Chinese. Chinese is the best. Um, oh, I love Chinese. I, I could, I could sit here and talk. So, when we had, just before lockdown, Mother's Day, I paid like forty odd quid for a Chinese for my mum and the family. Yeah, my mum and my sister, and um, <clears throat> and it was disgusting. We had Mandarin, uh, no Mayflower, Mayflower, and it was absolutely rank. Um, Pizza for me, seafood or Hawaiian. Oh, seafood on a pizza. Don't think I'd ever try that. Um, <laughs> and I don't like pineapple. Uh, so, my favourite pizzas for me are a pepperoni or a meat feast. Um, best Indian I've had was the curry cart. What delivers now? Yeah, but they only deliver on certain days, didn't they, Bert? I just, I'm not a seafood lover. Um, <clears throat> don't like seafood, so. Yeah, I just don't, I'm not a fish lover. I like paella. Paella is really nice. That's the only time I eat fish is in a paella. Pineapple should, pineapple should not be on a pizza quite by Gordon Ramsay. You said it. You've hit the nail on the head there, Josh. Pineapple shouldn't. What are your plans for tonight? I, I'll come off stream. At, uh, it's 11 o'clock now. I'll stay until half 11 and I'm coming off at half 11. No 12 hour, no three hour stream tonight. Uh, half eleven will be the latest I'll stand tonight. Um, <clears throat> I'll go downstairs. I'll ring Robert. Speak to Rob on the phone. Uh, and then I think I'm gonna watch both my episodes of Chicago Fire that um, I didn't I haven't watched the last two weeks. Also, Josh, what do you think on uh, Friday night dinner? Have you watched last night's episode? I hate to say it, but I think pineapple should be in a black bag. You're right. <laughs> um, I I honestly that hate to say it. I think that's that's the last episode. I I do think that's the last episode of Friday Night Dinner. The way they ended it with Jackie, you know, nah. I think that's it. But it was po posted on Twitter by Boohoo and Robert Popper, or whatever the hell his name is, the producer, the writer, he turned around and said, it's news to him that it's the last series, so hopefully not. Um, but where can they go from it? Uh, I'm not going to spoil it, Joanna, because you ain't seen it. I'm not going to spoil it. Um, but what happened last night, where can they go from that? Because I don't think it'll be fun if if everything everything happens and then and then they start coming. It, it, it can't go anywhere. It weren't really a cliffhanger though, Rob. It wasn't a cliffhanger. They just kind of. It was a really happy ending. And it stops. That's it. Have you watched last night's yet, Rob? Have you watched last night's yet, Rob? 
I thought it was awesome. <clears throat> I'd say it's probably one of the best episodes that that's ever been. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Oh, that's good style like that. Who wants to go? <laughs> Want to call cream tea now? Jibby. I am the Jibby. I am the Jibby. <gasps> Josh, tap, tap, tap. One in my garden there. Yeah, unnecessary travel still won't be lifted, Rob. They are talking about increasing the fine if it was a broken. Tell my kind to cock up me more. You're not very professional, are you, Rob? <laughs> oh, I know, I know. We've got people out in, in our street. They had a street party outside ours the other day. There's people having a street party out in Hollywood. I shouldn't have told you where I live then. <laughs> oh well. <clears throat> if I get stalked, I get stalked. I'll invite you in for a cup of tea. <laughs> Cool, they come in for a cup of tea. If they've come from far, I let them stay the night so they don't have to travel all in one day because, you know, unnecessary travel and all that. Um, cool. Crikey, imagine life under Bert's laws. We'd all be dead. We would. You wouldn't be, Rob. You're too small. He wouldn't. Don't put ideas in his head. He wouldn't. Him, a man can dream. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think they should be able to dream. Not Rob. What was that, Rob? You'll find people for eat, eating on their live stream. Mmm. Cheeky, cheeky. Who was it that asked me to do food challenges? Bad Milson. Oh, another one I like. Um, is, you know, when Mr. Morris proposes to Grandma and um, Jim dresses up as the dog. 
and he's raising money for this little dog that no, can no longer eat chicky. Can't eat no, no more chicky. I remember YouTube pays this month such as such a shame the fine is your half. No, it ain't, mate. You get us a fine. <sighs> Do a bush to control for a change using Bardis Sex and BM. No, I've done them already. It was horrible. I done one last I think I done it at Christmas around Rob's. Uh, all the jelly bean one. Uh, I've done that around Rob's as well. Rob threw up. That was fun. That was funny to watch Rob being sick. I don't like them nasty beans. <laughs> I don't think anyone likes those nasty beans. The jelly beans you got from Harry Potter World Studios are gross. Yeah, they're horrible. Favourite scene when Grandma Portons pretends to have a heart attack on her own wedding. Yeah, that was funny. Um, Jackie, I'm not ill. Of course you're not, mummy. I'm not ill. I'm pretending. Who do you prefer, though? Do you prefer a nice grandma or a horrible grandma? I'm not going to lie, I do quite like bag, a horrible grandma, but I like nice grandma as well, but I think she was a little bit, I don't know, ah, uh, the plastic bag, yeah, <laughs> that's a good episode. I could get stuff in my eye. I think there are sires. Say that, Teresa. Horrible grandma would be killed off. What colour are the curtains? Yellow. Is that the views that, that video has got now, Rob? Slowed up now, isn't it? Oh, crikey's. Yeah. Are you the facilities now? Are you watching the Jimmy episode? Or are you watching last night's? I can't stand her. I don't even. I, what's her name? Um, 
But Jibby, I can't stand the actor, actress. I really don't like her. Didn't like her Miranda. Don't like her in this. Oh. <laughs> I am the Jibby. I reckon I can stick out another five minutes, guys, I reckon. I'll stick for another five minutes. So, get your last questions in. That's my lucky meat. It's lovely meat. There is nothing wrong with that meat. I'll prove it to you. I'll prove there's nothing wrong with that meat. Valerie! Martin, you're going to be fine. Oh, God. I'm going to head off now. I'm going to watch last night's on my phone. Okie dokie. Um, I'm sticking it out for another three minutes or so. I'm going to go to 135 minutes and then I'm going to be coming off the stream anyway. Pardon me. Any more questions, guys? Start closing things down now. It's kind of sat here looking into empty space. Like, hmm, anyone going to laugh at anything? Yeah, I think me too. Yeah, Rob, I agree. Um, if you're new on here, give, smash that thumbs up button because every like really helps us out, guys. Unfortunately, you can't do it more than once, I'm afraid. I wish you could. Hopefully. Tonight, tonight was a bit of a dead stream, to be honest. Yeah, right at the start. Yeah. I think it's because it's Saturday night, and everyone watching the TV. Right, guys. Um, right. Just um, right out on there. Okay, guys. Um, that is the end of the stream. Yeah, true. It's Friday night. I would be if I went on here. Um, okay, um, so thank you to everyone that's come on to our stream tonight. Uh, really appreciate it, as always. Thank you if you've liked. Um, and we hope to see you tomorrow. So um, thank you, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow, guys.